I'll just lay out the, the scenario here. He's 45 years old. He was recovering from his fifth back surgery. He's had four surgeries to his left knee. Now he has a rod in his right leg, screws and pins near the ankle area and foot area. He had another fracture in another portion of his leg. As far as golf swings go, we know that ankle injuries are one of the worst. Uh, you, your mobility is brought into question. If he doesn't have any vascular problems going forward, and if he's able to recover somewhat, that's a lot of questions that need to be answered. And I just don't know if he's able to do that again. The one thing that might push him forward would be his son, Charlie. It's interesting that during COVID-19, Charlie fell in love with the game because with uh, restrictions and things that you had to do to follow safety protocols with COVID-19, you had to play with a family member. You could only play with a family member. And Charlie and Tiger went out repeatedly. So maybe he might get pushed forward by Charlie. But again, that's a long way away. Uh, we know Tiger came back from Fuse back, which was a miracle to win the Masters in 2019. But now you put all of this on it, on his body, um, that, that's going to be a big, big ask for him to, to conquer. Almost every sports star and celebrity you could think of weighed in, you know, from uh, past presidents Barack Obama and Donald Trump. I'm here at the concussion, at the concession golf club in uh, Bradenton, Florida for the World Golf Championships Work Day Championship at the concession. Um, and the, the day yesterday was absolutely perfect. Blue skies, sun, it was just absolutely perfect. And then word started to spread across the golf course and suddenly the mood just, just went straight south and prayers went straight north. And, um, you know, Justin Thomas, one of his, who's become a very good friend of Tiger Woods, um, he, he, he teared up. He was very emotional talking about uh, he's hoping in, for the best for Tiger and, and hoping for the best for his two kids. Um, John Rahm talked about, uh, you know, hasn't Tiger been, his body been through enough? Um, and the mood is sour. It's soured, definitely soured. Um, and I think it might have perked up just a hair as we got word uh, late Wednesday night, uh, Tuesday night, that uh, he was responsive, he was awake, he was recovering after the surgeries. Um, and so at least that's good. And um, so now everybody's in a waiting game. Hey, sports fans, if you want to see more videos like this, check out some of our other ones right here. And if you like what you see, make sure to hit the subscribe button and stay tuned for more from USA Today Sports.